2,049. 2,050. Yeah, I did start the camera with my nose. Got a problem? I like my big nose. Who's that? Who's that? What you want? Police. We've had some complaints about con men pretending to be blind and uh, cripple. Oh, I'd love to help you, man, but I ain't seen nothing since I stepped on that landmine in Viet Cong back in 72. It was rough. Very painful. Hello, hello, everybody. It is Dennis Allen here. I am in a really bad mood today, as you can surely hear. It's 20 degrees outside, and I forgot to winterize, so that's today's video. I hope you will stay and not go. I, so I don't write this. I mean, people write this, and it's... This is just what they make me do. Good morning, everybody. That was a silly song, and I am actually in a very good mood. You coming? Uh, it is really 20-something degrees, like early 20s. Does that make sense? Early 20s? No. Uh, low 20s? Early 20s. It's the early 20s. It's the roaring 20s. Hey, did anybody realize, did anybody realize that... Um, it's going to be the 20s again? That's pretty cool. I always said that I wanted to live in the 20s. And by gosh, I'm going to. There's a moon up there. I don't know where you could see, if you could see it. Somewhere up there. I can't see it because it's bright and sunny. I haven't shot a lot of videos in a while. I'm sorry. A lot's been uh, changing. Getting... Getting the poop word done, if you know what I mean. Um, I guess I won't talk about what I've been doing because you probably just saw it yesterday in the or a couple days ago video. But for me, it's exciting as heck. I guess it's exciting for you too if you watch these things. It's oh man, I don't know where the four wheeler is. Oh, it's downstairs. I drove Mini Winnie up here last night. Um, it was really cold. It was like 20 or getting getting that low. So I decided to drive her up. I didn't want to uh I didn't want to What did I want to do? I didn't want to take the four-wheeler up the hill. It's loud and so I just parked there in my parking spot and then just walked up here. Lucky I got a couple parking spots on this property. So I used my remote start, which I might actually put into Mini instead of the Jeep. Daisy's got a remote start, so I could just go up there and start her up, which would be great if there was a power out situation or if we're working remotely. Did you see the light bulb? Bing! So bright idea. I'm gonna keep the remote are in the Jeep. Oh, look at Daisy. She got a little flat tire. Oh, it's okay. I fix her. Oh, look at that. Eddie Santos, don't yell at me. I know I need tires. I would, I do want a little bigger though. So, what, what do we gotta do? I'll cut stuff. I don't care. I'll cut this piece. I did. Remember my Cherokee? I cut the fender so I could be, put bigger tires in it. I had a 97 Guys, I know it's really hard to keep track of my storyline, but maybe you could take notes. So I had a 97 Grand Cherokee Limited, top of line everything, heated side mirrors, those things. Um, did I point that right? Yeah. Um, and I lifted it, I think total it was six and a half inches. It was fun. Future Dennis, put the video in, yeah man. I really like it. Woo! I'm just picturing now. Oh, I gotta edit out some curse words. That's Todd, that's uh, Claudia. That's actually Claudia that was in that yelling. That is Eddie Murphy's. Huh. I, I'm, I'm inclined to say mother because Eddie Murphy is Charlie Murphy's 
brother, Charlie Murphy, is the dog that he's babysit. We started calling him Charlie Murphy. And um, oh, you saw the video before. <laughs> Punches him in the face. So that's Charlie Murphy. That's Eddie Murphy's brother. So Claudia is the original mother of Charlie Murphy. So how could I don't know? I'm gonna have to do a paternity test to see if Claudia or Logo is the mother. I think it's gotta be Logo. Yeah, he's Puerto Rican. Um, so I wish someone was taking notes that I could read right now because I don't know what the heck I was talking about. But I'm taking the Jeep. Oh, the remote start. So listen to this. I uh, remote start it. I could see when I have a compressor. See the air things? Um, when I'm out on the shop, like we were, I borrowed a air compressor the other day from Mike Huey from Back to Basics Farm. Um, because I didn't want to use Jeep because I would have to start it every single time, you know, go down, jump in there. So if I had a remote start, I could just remote start it and then have the air, air compressor on and I could shut it off with that. So it's kind of a waste, but it'd be good for an accessory. Anyway, enough thinking. So I just started it right now just to get it up and get the squirrels out. I'm gonna upcycle my bag somehow. So I brought her in here. I'm gonna put that on the back so it could be like a utility bag. It's a good bag, but the zipper's broke, breaking. Um, that's it for now. Okay, so I was really thinking before I said okay, so to not say okay, so. But then I decided to say, okay, so. Okay, so you have no idea what the video is about. So because it's so cold and I wait to the last second, or actually after the last second, um, well, I got a big thing of hot tea. Uh, I'm gonna winterize. I'm actually going to build um, a stone wall around the <laughs> west side highway no it's uh, the west side of the teddy so I'm gonna build a stone wall and maybe stuff it with some uh, hay just so the wind can't really whip through it you know um, I don't want to completely close it off because of the condensation will get moldy and everything there it will be open I think it's gonna be Eddie's home I'm gonna somehow uh, you know maybe surround the whole thing and maybe the front where I could just like open up a gate or something to take Teddy in and out will be uh, his his home because I'd like him to sleep outside most of the time and uh, I actually I think it'll it'll be warm under there especially with the uh, the heat thing going on the uh, the uh, wood burning stove so I'm gonna winterize I'm gonna build that stone wall I'm going to get uh, my storm windows I made. I kind of just cut plexiglass, or actually Josh. If you just put Josh in there. Got some blacksmithing going on with Josh. He works at the hardware store and he custom made me some plexiglass things, which you'll see, uh, to replace the storm windows, uh, the screen. So I'm going into my shop. There's my new workshop. Thank you very much, very, thank you very much, Steve. I really appreciate what you're doing, man. Steve's uh, helping me build that. Actually, I'm helping Steve build that. Um, yeah, Steve, I'm actually, by, well, you know, well, yeah. I, uh, I just sent you, or I'm sending you a, uh, it didn't go through yet, a thank you because I really appreciate what you're doing for me, man. It's. It's so beautiful and amazing that that was a squirrel moment because it literally was a squirrel and I just wanted to make sure it wasn't anything like a mountain lion. Um, I really appreciate what you're doing for me, man. It's it's the greatest thing. It's, uh, it's really touching, man. I really, really appreciate it. <sighs> so, yeah. So, I'm going to go to the shop. We're going to get some stones. We're going to get my... Panels, I'm going to do the stones first, this way, because uh, I need little, I want to get a little rubber washers, like Priya, Priya, Priya Teen, Priya So, Priya So, look at Rock Face, 
it's all gone. Take it all away. I don't know what to do with it. That's slowly falling down. Oh, okay, so that's perfect. So see how it's slowly falling down right there? It falls down to that one. Look at the, how big that rock is. So what I'm going to do, I'm not taking that one. Maybe I will. No, that's too big. That guy was definitely up there. Not Eddie. Hey. Stay over here. He's been finding dead deer and pigs with tucks. I don't I I guess boars have tusks, don't they? I don't know. I don't know how it works. I'm still learning these things. I'm still learning what the calves and the cows and the the bulls and all that different of the cows or different types of cows, different names. I thought they were just cows, the boy cows, the girl cows. Nope. They got different ones. They have milkers and shakers and stuff like that. Some of the milkers bring the boys to the yard. And their life is better than yours. Damn right. It's better than yours. I could teach you. Um, so yeah, so on the other side of that is where we're gonna get some stones from because it's doing the same thing on the other side. The echo sounds amazing in here, especially when you sound like Captain Kirk in a really bad... What do you call it? You uh, mimic someone's voice? Interpretation? No. The ice froze. Guy staying ring, ice skating ring. Whoa. Ooh, maybe an ice skating ring in the quarry one day. Um, there's water, I left it out. I wanted to experiment to see if it would freeze overnight. And it's not that frozen. I thought it would, uh, you know. That was stupid, because now it's definitely gonna freeze. I was just thinking I was just gonna do it for a day, but how am I gonna defrost it now? Past Dennis, sometimes, you just don't think. Or maybe I'll just put it in the sun all day. Anyway, so I'm gonna grab the rocks on the other side of that cliff. It's, they are falling too down to the earth and they are actually landing in the driveway. So instead of constantly picking them off the, uh, well, let's just go see it. I don't wanna hit stop. Oh, I'm going to hit stop because it's going to be... Oh, so let me just show you where we are. There's the stage. That's where Bon Jovi played last week. That's a lie. There's an airplane. There's the moon. So this is the road. The rocks are falling. Let me show you. I'm using my nose to turn this off because it's cold. I don't want to take my gloves off. All right. Oh, I see. oh I'm doing this for the, for the show. But I did it, so, hey, whatever. That one, 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 that one. Some over there. I mean, I could, obviously, I don't have to really look for rock. A rock. <laughs> that cliff goes all the way down to the floor. That looks like that. Not that. Looks like that, underneath that. So all that rock, I got. So instead of taking it from there, I'll take it from here, that came from up there. So this is fresh quarried rock. So it is a lot of fossils and I'm sure I'll show you some. So let me get Billy Ray. Yo, Billy Ray! <whistles> Billy! Billy Ray Valentine! He's not sleeping, he's probably sleeping or drunk. He is an alcoholic. Fortunately, we were working on that. No, he wasn't an alcoholic. He played an alcoholic. No, he didn't play an alcoholic. He, at the beginning, he was... Who's that? Who's he that? never Who's drank. I don't know. Anyway, let me get Billy ready. I'm going to get the cart hooked up and uh, start my day. Okay? What do you say? <coughs> <coughs> Stay tuned for these commercials. <coughs> Eddie, you want to say those lines? Woo! Stay tuned for these commercial messages. Hey everybody, got a broken computer? Contact Hack Shack Computers at some phone number that I don't know. Or a website that I don't know. But that is Steve's um, 
old computer company. Guy I was building this. Pay attention, people. He owned that computer company. He gave me that. I love it. So this is the cart that is being pulled by Billy. I got my stove in here that I found in the trash in Jersey City. Thank you, rich people. Uh, from Jersey City, I throw things in the garbage. Thank you, Jersey City Police, for letting me uh, borrow this. Really appreciate it. I'm gonna hang it up in your honor. Please fit. Yes. I really don't like that, but I like that it was given to me by a very easily removed screw. Um, and you know what, they don't even, that was like not even used anymore. So it, there used to be a, there was a lot that had a shipping container, kind of like a substation police thing. And that was parked, that was in the lot, and then the lot was sold, and that was still there. So I know the person that owned the lot. So it was kind of unofficially stolen. I'm using this for the firewood, all the cuttings. This is gonna be perfect for the, uh, for my little wood burning stove that is coming, it's here as you've seen the uh, videos, but ah, it fell on my foot. But this is garbage. Anybody want this? Got a nice, oh no, it's not garbage. Oh yes, this is broken. Put that over here in there, Abe. It's a mess, people, I know. I'm in the middle of building stuff. Stop you crying. All right. So, oh, I gotta turn Billy around. Billy, calm down. All right, let me get this over there. Actually, I'll just leave it over here. Oh, that's that's. I, I guess I could say so. That sucks. My uh, I just lost reverse. I put in reverse, went back, and it sounded like it popped out of gear. But it didn't pop out of gear. It just doesn't go into reverse anymore. So that's adding a little challenge to the day, people. Whatever. Oh boy. So. I wasn't sure what happened to Billy Ray and why he didn't want to go that way. No mo. So I took a quick look under the hood and I see fluid. Ah! That's the exhaust. I see fluid leaking. So something popped or broke. So I can't use Billy Ray today, so I think that rock project is a f I don't want to say officially over. I can live with the coal for another day. I really need Billy up and running a-okay. Um, Oh, that just changed my day. Hear what I'm saying? Ing. That didn't run. There's a plane. Um, I don't want to work on Billy today. It's cold. I'm working on cars. And... Well, actually, it'd be better I work on it now. Sorry for the thinking on camera, folks. Um, yeah, I probably will do it. It's still warm. The engine's nice and warm. Uh... Yeah, I'm gonna drive it up on the stilts and uh, check it out, man. I keep looking over there. I don't know which way the camera is. Whatever. I ain't professional. Oh, did you fall? No, you didn't. 20 hub! 20 hub? That was supposed to be a number. I was gonna say 27, but I was like, hey, let me lie and say it's like 2700, and it came out weird. 2047, 2048, 2049, 2050. All right, people. So I got my push-ups done for the day. I think that's, that what you just saw was probably for the, for the month. The big airplane. Huh, you, you don't see big airplanes. So I'm gonna do this, pay attention. How you start this? Pause. 
for a second. Real quick, I'm sorry. I'm gonna, I'm gonna build that up. I'm just gonna, it'll just push itself. Luckily we got all these scrap woodies. I can do that. You think these are gonna stay there? Probably not, right? These are the extra pieces from the uh, shipping container shop. Oh wait, they're different sizes. But they're good enough. I guess this is more playing than actually doing it the right way. That's for sure. Because this probably isn't the safest or smartest way. But I was thinking about using these extra pieces as my... Uh, you think that's even gonna stay? I might just even push that. Oh. I'm I usually do a couple laps around the neighborhood. Woo. All right, let's see if this. This might work better. What do you think about that? And it took a lot easier to build. Sometimes you gotta think where you head. That's it. That's what you gotta do. Are you recording? Oh yeah, you are. Alright. I'm gonna stop running. I'm doing it for the to save to make the video shorter for you, but I'm getting way too hot. Sometimes you think we had, I don't say I do it all the time, because that was dumb and now I'm stuck. I guess I can shut off. Um, I did that so I could see the back. Alright, that was supposed to be the end effect. Okay, now I'm gonna lay underneath here. No, I'm not that stupid. I'm gonna put the emergency brake on. And I'm gonna chuck the tires. That's double protection, people. Pull. Do, am I okay during this? With my dirty coat? Yeah. Um, doing it this way, it's called a double wobble. Double protection is a double wobble. That's when you, my father's told me that when you tie your knots and you do it twice, it's a double wobble. That's just a little bit of English lesson for you people. I do that, I give those English lessons for the Amish out there. To all my Amish neighbors watching, thank you. Okay, here's a little homestead tip. Here's a homestead tip of the day, folks. See the old uh, cooking baskets? I save them for my oil pans, or oil pan. And what makes it so great, besides upcycling, is that once it's full of oil, you could just put it in the creek and float it down the stream. Okay, folks, so... I don't know if I should show you this on camera. Anybody, if your children are watching, please turn away. Um, Billy Ray has a hole in his back. He broke his back somehow. I guess maybe because of the cold. It was so cold. But see the metal? I don't know if, what you could see in there. But it doesn't look good for Billy. That looks like a uh, ooh. 
That looks like a lot of work. Um, I was going to take things apart and look around and see what happened, but I don't even have to. I could just see it from here that this is not running today or anytime soon, so. Ooh, that's no good. It's a sad day in Woodward, PA for Billy Ray. <sighs> Okay, I'm over it. Um, so that's another project. Stay tuned for a future video. How to fix a transfer case on a Honda four-wheeler. So that project is done now. Oh, <laughs> I mean, I got to do a lot of walking. Yeah. All right, looks like Daisy is back to being the farmhand so not a problem i like driving daisy i actually have to put her top on because she's like oh it's cold outside with my top off um she wants to put a hard top on uh was that that was okay right all right so i'm still gonna winterize i can feel the back of uh of daisy yeah, I could still do the rocks. I'm going to fill up the back of Daisy and just use the Daisy to go up and down, down and up, up and down, down and up. All right, so, yeah, nothing's changed except for one of the actors. So, Billy Ray, you're fired. No, you're not fired, but I just, you got hurt. That's, that's, that's why we have workman's comp, people, you know. All the tractor-trailer drivers that are going to be used, I got to just wait now for the tractor-trailer to come because obviously I can't film and drive up and down my road. That would be super dangerous. So I gotta wait for the tractor trailer drivers. They all have health insurance. Billy Ray, do you have health? No, he don't have insurance. Does he have insurance? No. I wonder if there's homeowners insurance. I don't have homeowners insurance. Oh, yes, I do. Okay, so what bird? Okay, yeah, I know. Um, yep, yeah. all right, so we're just gonna get Daisy. See you next week. Same bad time, same bad station.